Hello. Can I get set up here good? Hey, if you're watching this and it doesn't say live, you're watching the replay. Thanks for joining me. I hope everybody had a great Mother's Day yesterday. My mom got to come down since we've all been quarantined. Um, we figured it was safe for her to visit with us for a little bit. But it was also a really rough day for us because yesterday um, was the one year anniversary of my dad passing away. So I really didn't want her to be alone. So it was good that she could come up and visit with us down, I guess, from her house. Um, so that was nice. I didn't want to post anything about it yesterday. I waited until today because I know I didn't want to put a damper on her Mother's Day. I love her. Um, she's back and watching baby Landon. All right, so we've had so many crazy things. Like I am tiling our bathroom <laughs> and I had the floor done and I just finished the grout while my mom was here and then tomorrow we're gonna start grouting the walls tiling the walls and painting the walls and we gotta get this bathroom done <laughs> so we can have kids in a bathtub Noah absolutely hates to take a um, shower he cries the whole time. So we got to get our bathroom done. Super important. Um, and then the other day we went out our front door. And the kids start screaming, snake, snake. And I'm, we're looking everywhere and they're standing with the door open. And the snake is literally like right under the door. There's this giant, like this big round rat snake. I've never even seen a black rat snake that big, but it's no longer with us um my husband and I both we do not like snakes so that sucker was not staying <laughs> and when we put the kids trampoline up down over the hill uh well I saw a baby snake and that was enough it freaked me out I'm like oh my god there's baby snake and that means there's more snakes so I saw the big snake it was over it was over so, hopefully I'll be posting uh, that our more home renovation getting finished. I wanted to just show you guys real quick a little five-minute look. I already have on my um, primers and my eyeshadow primer. So, just super quick to get ready today. Um, if you're hopping on, you can give me some likes and hearts. Um, my kids are sitting beside me taking their eye ready tests. <laughs> So if you hear lots of noise and sound effects, they're uh, doing their eye ready test. I'm going to use this BB cream. It might be a little bit dark for me. That was my summer. A lot of people ask how different it is than the CC cream. And it is just a beauty balm. And I'm going to just put that on. Some people don't want a ton of coverage, but I, it still has fairly good coverage over all my, yeah, you can take a break. Are you at 50? Um, in a little bit, I promise Catherine, if she finishes, she's going to come on and do a video for you with some new products that we got. Yeah, babe. No, I can't pause it. Hi, guys. If you're hopping on, we're just doing a real fast uh, five minute look. Okay, so that's the BB cream. It's a little bit darker than what I need right now, but the coverage is still pretty good. I do have primer on under it, too. Alright, then the face perfecting powder I posted about the other day in the makeup group I've already used a lot of it um, I just feel it's really good it's some of the best powder I have used guys get 
Just no. Mm -hmm. You can do it yourself. I don't want to do it. I'll help you. I don't, you don't know what I'm typing in. I'm typing what? All right. And the powder also comes with a little sponge. If you like to put it on better that way. It does have a little sponge. It makes the coverage a little heavier. But of all our powders, this is my favorite coverage. I think it might even be the cheapest one, but the face perfecting pressed powder is the best. Alright, then I have all right, some yellow stripes on. So I'm going to do the gold pop. You can use your finger. I've been looking for this brush forever. I have a little cream shadow brush. It's not from pharmacy. You can get one from anywhere. You sit here. You sit here. I do like to use my fingers too. Catherine, please don't make everybody scream right now. Use some colors that are really different so you guys can see really well. S. If you're hopping on or watching the replay, you can let us know. How was your Mother's Day? Did you stay quarantined? Did you get to see your mom? What did your kids do for you? We planted some flowers. We got some flowers from Butcher's Farm. Yeah. What else did we do? My kids made me cards. My husband got me a card. And he bought me this really big piece of artwork but it's really cool it has all three of the kids names like on a beach scene they're on signs it's really cool just had to have find somewhere to hang it it's a lot bigger than... and i didn't pick it out myself he got it all by himself all right so on top of this gold here we're gonna Put some of this turquoise eyeliner, just because they're kind of, I feel like that'll be a good color contradiction for you guys to see how good it is. In the summer, if we get to leave our houses, these uh, bright colors and metallics and glitters are going to be all over the place. So this is... The metallic turquoise eyeliner. And it comes in a dip liner. So it just has a little brush. I felt like this was really intimidating, but I never had used liquid eyeliner. And I really feel like it's pretty easy. To paint on so if you feel like you're afraid of liquid eyeliner don't be it might almost be easier than the stick the or the pencil because the bristles just kind of glide and you can control how thick you want it to be it doesn't really bleed so I feel like my lines are pretty straight with it you can make it as thin or as thick as you want if you want to wing, you can wing it pretty easily. Wish I had blue eyes. This would probably look super good with blue eyes. Um, Oh 
I feel like that's pretty even. I did not do a wing today just because that takes longer. I was trying to do about five minutes. I forgot to set my timer, so sorry. All right, so I'm gonna let that dry and hop over to my three-in-one face palette. I really like these. I feel like if you want to start with just one product, it has the um, blush and a really flattering color for everybody. It has highlighter, which makes good eyeshadow too. Um, and then the contour or bronzer. You can use the either way. If you want to put it all over as a bronzer, it's a really good color. If you just want to chisel out your cheekbones a little bit, it's really good for that too. Add a little warmth around your a hairline. Move out around your chin. And just kind of connect those. I like to go down my nose with the darker color. Just kind of shape your nose a little. That's normally all I do with the contour. Then you can just take a tiny little bit of highlight on top of your cheeks. Down your nose, your forehead. You can do it like right around your lip to kind of make your lips look a little bigger. And, hey Luke, come here for a minute. All right, let me put some blush here. Come over here and get me um, a lipstick or a lip gloss. Just go with whatever he picks, because I'm not going anywhere now. In the kitchen, honey. All right, everybody. Just coming in now. I told them if they got halfway done, they could take a break from their testing. It's, it's number nine. Ooh, we're going bold. <laughs> <laughs> so, since my eyes should be dry, we're going to do the 3D Effects Mascara. It is um, high definition mascara. So it really separates and defines all your lashes. One thing I know, Pharmacy is coming out with falsies. I don't know if they're glue on or magnetic. But I'm so super excited for that because I have tried to get my lashes to grow out but you can kind of hear the chaos right now and a lot of times I forget to put my stuff on twice a day when I was doing it twice a day I do feel like there was some improvement all right so there I'm you can see just a little coat of mascara. Alright guys. Calm down or break's going to be over. I'm not thrilled about taking their testing at home anyway. Stop. Catherine. Catherine. Enough. She likes to pick Noah up and carry him and mother him and smother him and make him scream and cry. So if you're looking for a live chaos, we're normally full of it. Alright. This is not the lip I would choose whatsoever, but apparently I forgot to get one. I don't know what this will look like with green eyes. But Luke grabbed one for me. This is one of my favorite colors. This is the number six superstar.
when you really want to spread it out. You don't want... Thick coverage anywhere. It is a nice dark red, isn't it? I love it. Looks like you're, there's like a big crusty piece. But your lips oh, just no. flapping. No, I didn't exfoliate my lips. I was gonna put gloss on. Oh, there's little white. Chips. I know. What is it? It's my lip. Let's get on my lip. It's peeling, isn't it? Tommy? All right. So that is our matte liquid lipstick this is the one that stays all day it moves a little bit which is good because you can get it where you want it and then it dries and you're good it won't come off on your drinks or anything okay she's excited later she's gonna tell you about the brown sugar line i just got the hand cream the body scrub and the shower gel in so she's been opening them and smelling them and she asked if she can make the video to tell you about those. So she will be live in a little bit. Okay, well, that's why you shouldn't be climbing. All right, then just real quick in my eyebrows. I know a lot of people think eyebrows don't make much difference, but as a person who doesn't have them very much, it does. My pencil needs sharpened and I can't find my sharpener. So you can see even just that scratching me. Just that tiny little bit. Filling in where the lines are. Or not. Alright, so... No, this looks very dramatic. <laughs> it was a really quick, just get ready makeup. I don't need that. So I hope you guys have a good day. We'll be back in a little bit and we will unbox some products. We have a FedEx shipment coming today and we will tell you about the brown sugar line. So I hope you have a great day. If your kids are doing eye ready testing, say a little prayer for you. <laughs> Have a great day and we'll catch you later. Bye.